हेलो एवरीवन इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट टिश्यू रिपेयर और टिश्यू हीलिंग हीलिंग इज द प्रोसेस ऑफ रिप्लेसमेंट ऑफ डेड टिश्यू बाय लिविंग टिश्यू हीलिंग इज ब्रॉडली डिवाइडेड इनटू रीजनरेशन एंड रिपेयर रीजनरेशन इट इज अ प्रोसेस इन व्हिच लॉस्ट टिश्यू इज रिप्लेस्ड बाय टिश्यू ऑफ सिमिलर टाइप रिपेयर इट इज अ प्रोसेस इन व्हिच लॉस्ट टिश्यू इज रिप्लेस्ड बाय फाइब्रस टिश्यू और स्कार फैक्टर्स डिसाइडिंग द पैटर्न ऑफ हीलिंग The regeneration and repair process of the healing depends on proliferating capacity of tissue. According to the proliferating capacity of the cells, the tissues of the body can be divided into three groups. First one is labile, continuous dividing tissue, proliferate throughout life. For example, hematopoietic cells of the bone marrow, surface epithelial of the skin, columnar epithelial of the gastrointestinal tract, stable quiescent tissue. proliferate in response to injury for example parenchymal cells of the liver kidney and pancreas permanent non dividing tissue cells that can't proliferate after birth for example neuron cells skeletal muscle cells and cardiac muscle cells factors affecting wound healing age of the patient type of wound poor nutrition edema chronic diseases like diabetes mellitus healing of fracture there are five stages in healing of fracture first one is stage of hematoma which lasts for about less than 7 days when a bone is fractured blood leaks out through the torn vessels in the bone and forms a hematoma between and around the fracture second stage is stage of granulation tissue which lasts for about 2 to 3 weeks proliferation and differentiation of daughter cells into vessels fibroblast osteoblast etc third one is the stage of callus which lasts for about 4 to 12 weeks mineralization of granulation tissue radiologically callus is visible fourth one is the stage of remodeling which lasts for about 1 to 2 years in this stage regular bone replaces the hard callus in x ray the bone would look uneven fifth one is the stage of modeling which lasts for many years in this stage the fracture site become indistinguishable from the parental bone 